Welcome back to another vlog. I don't know what this vlog is going to be like. It's kind of, I don't know. All I know is that it's just really, really cloudy and it's been all day. So if, it, if the sun isn't shining, I mean, the valley is kind of, as you can see, very lifeless. The river is flowing, but other than that, it's too dark. If it's dreary, the valley isn't yet green, I'm kind of like, meh. I don't know, we'll have to see. I want to get the, the little bit of ice that's left on the river before it's gone. That's why I'm here today. This is what I'm currently reading. It's actually quite fascinating. He's saying that whether you have thousands of followers, whether you have under 100, the way you influence the people around you is important. Even if you're somebody that doesn't have a social media at all, just a small group of people that you're around and how you influence them is important. Oh, I actually thought it would be easier to see, but there's some buckets beside some trees here, and they're collecting sap. On the way back from my walk yesterday, I saw them checking their buckets, so um, I don't know when they will boil it down, I guess, once they have enough. I don't know, I'm sorry, I don't know anything about sap collecting. This is only the second year we're doing it. There's two couples that do that. I'll be honest, maple syrup is not my favorite thing. <laughs> I don't like maple syrup and I don't like ketchup chips. And when I mention it to people, I'm like, am I truly Canadian if I don't like ketchup chips and maple syrup? I don't know, each to their own. <laughs> a package pesa anyways i have those package i think i know what it is it is so this company reached out to me and asked me if i wanted to try one of their products and i'm like yes absolutely i i'm excited for this i am excited for this so <laughs> This is basically a red light therapy device. You stick it up your nose. I'm not kidding, you do. You stick it up your nose. If you're new and don't know, I'm an all natural girly. Mm, I just I just love all natural products. I love going the all natural route. So basically, yep, yeah, this is what it is. This teeny tiny gadget here. It's a chart. <gasps> Wait, I'll read here. The product is used for intranasal irradiation to relieve nasal congestion, runny nose, sneezing, and other symptoms caused by allergic rhinitis. Rhinitis, rhinite, rhinitis. <laughs> These words, they get me. 
So basically, there we go. No more codes. I should give it to my brother. He has a problem with that. I am excited. I'm excited to try it. What am I doing with my hands? They also gave me a, a link that you can use where you get a discount if you are interested in purchasing the product. I want to be totally transparent with you. I did not get paid for this. I didn't. I was asked if I would like to try it and it seems like these people know me very well. I appreciate it. I do. I do. I will try it out and let you know, most definitely. But until then, feel free to check out the company. They seem like I checked them out. They seem like a very cool company. I'm excited. So if you're ever in the Winnipeg area and antiques are your jam, check out the Old House Revival Company. It's a wonderful place. They have a lot of good stuff. needed It's windy, truly really windy. Today's Saturday. I kind of ended the last clips a little bit weirdly, so I just wanted to explain a little bit more. I think Thursday was the last bigger chunk that I recorded for you, but we had a greenhouse day. We started at 8.30 and we went until a little bit after two in the afternoon, so it was a lot longer, but some days are like that. And then, what did we do? We had to transplant cabbage, broccoli, cauliflower, tomatoes, dahlias. There was a different type of flower that we also transplanted, but unfortunately I can see the plant, but the name escaped my mind. <laughs> and then Friday, I just did the weekly Friday cleaning. Connie and I are out for a walk and she's getting antsy. She's sitting over here by the trees. When I pulled out the camera, she wanted to jump up. If you wanted to jump up on this, I, there's a little bit of a ledge here. That's where you're sitting on and she wanted to jump up and sit on there. Why? I, I don't know. Beats me. Um, the river is kind of low for this time of year. Kind of low. Generally, in April, it's all the way up here to the bank, which makes perfect for kayaking, but that is low. Then next week, they say it's supposed to rain and snow. I don't think it's gonna snow, but it's gonna rain. Not that I mind it. I'm here for the rain. Because this needs to rise so that I can go on a kayak. I wanted to go home and bake banana muffins, a healthier banana muffin, but... Right now I'm rethinking that, but I don't know, I might after I get home. Okay, I'm just rambling a lot at this point, so... Kona and I are going to continue on our walk. Bis rechts zu gehen. 
Yep, she's ready to go. I decided to make the muffins anyways. <laughs> because, I mean, <laughs> the bananas were gonna go bad, so. Sorry, somebody is teaching me how to do something on Instagram, so. <laughs> I'm reading that while I'm mashing my bananas. I made this recipe before, but I only, I posted it on Instagram. Well, I got it from Instagram. I don't know if that was satisfying or not, but it was for me. I think this one got all the chocolate chips.